Assalamu alaikum. This video has been produced by the healthcare professionals at the British Islamic Medical Association who wish for you to have a healthy Ramadan. So, how can we eat healthy this Ramadan? Use the NHS Eat Well Guide to guide your choices in terms of portion sizes and food types. The Prophet advised us to take benefit of 5 before 5. Your youth before your old age, your health before your sickness, your wealth before your poverty, your free time before you are preoccupied, and your life before your death. Let's focus on your health before sickness. Use Ramadan as the perfect opportunity to live with healthy eating principles. Use the Eat Well plate that's available on the NHS website to guide your choice of the different food groups that are available to you so that you have an optimum balance of fats, carbohydrates and proteins. And please also consider your portion sizes. Where possible, choose wholesome, ethically sourced, non-processed food. Opt for fibre-rich and complex carbs. Examples of high fibre include bran, cereals, whole wheat, grains and seeds. Potatoes, preferably with the skin. Vegetables such as green beans and almost all fruit, including apricots, prunes and figs. Dry fruit is not recommended for diabetics. High fibre foods that provide slow releasing energy are porridge, perfect for zoo, whole grain pita bread and chapati, perfect for iftar. Not only do they give you energy for longer, they keep you fuller, they're good for blood sugar control and they're good for constipation during Ramadan. Complex carbs include grains and seeds like wheat, barley, oats, millet, semolina and basmati rice. Noticing a pattern yet? Great non meat protein sources include lentils and beans. Another practical thing to do is to delay the suhoor as late as possible. At iftar time, avoid overeating. This will not only give you abdomen and bowel discomfort, but will also make your evening prayer much harder, as you'll be feeling very tired. Remember, the high fiber, complex carb, and eat well plate to guide your decisions. Open iftar with an odd number of dates, one or three, and preferably a glass of milk or water. Consider meals that have been grilled, steamed, baked, air fried versus the typical fried options that we have. Use the internet and your imagination for great ideas like falafel burgers, colorful salad, moussaka, grilled chicken tikka, air fried vegetable rolls and African dishes like pounded yam and air fried vegetables. The list is endless. Share your healthy recipes and remember to tag Bima with the hashtag B-I-M-A. In lockdown, it is imperative you plan ahead. Try to limit visits to the supermarket to every seven days or even better, 14 days. With a meal plan, this is more than achievable. Remember to consider meals for those people around you that are self-isolating. Also, remember to follow the guidelines of social distancing when delivering the food. Get planning, get imaginative, make healthy swaps. We pray for you all to have a, a beautiful Ramadan, full of blessings, and remember, stay safe and be kind to yourself and others.